Can we talk a little bit about a show that I know we all love now mm -hmm. and are obsessed? <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't going to say that, but yes, we are, we are obsessed. We're talking about Scandal. And last week on the show, something happened between Kerry Washington. That was crazy. Yeah. That was crazy. <laughs> and Tony Goldwyn. It was crazy. It was crazy. Little We're talking about involved. this. It gave all of us gladiators a little glimmer of hope about their future. Yes, it did, Kevin. And I had a chance to talk to Tony about this when he stopped by our set. <laughs> Hallelujah, she put the ring back <laughs> on. Is there hope for Olivia and President Grant? What is up with you and Olivia? She gave you a faint smile there as well. She so put the ring back on. I'm thinking there's hope, is there? I'm, there is definitely hope. See, yes. yes. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get that girl. You're gonna get that girl. Yep. You're not gonna stop till you happen. get that girl. I have girl. no idea if that's true, by the way, <laughs> just by disclaimer. <laughs> but as far as I'm concerned, it's gonna happen. Everyone seems to just root for you and Olivia. I mean, it's so messy, but it's so right. Isn't that insane, too? Yeah. I mean, we both behave really badly a lot of the time. Of course, you know, you, you start opposite um, Patrick Swayze mm -hmm. and Demi Moore in Ghost, but you are also Hollywood royalty, if people at home don't know. You know, Metro Goldwyn Mayor, MGM, you are the grandson of Sam Goldwyn. Mm -hmm, that's right. The, yeah, the G in MGM. Yeah, it's true, you know, my grandpa really was one of the people that started the movie business. But Tony knew little about his mom's side of the family, so he came to TLC's Who Do You Think You Are? He was ashamed to learn his great, great, great grandparents had racist and bigoted views, which they wrote about after they moved to Oregon in the 1860s. My progressive great, great, great grandfather, Nathaniel Coe, was perhaps not so progressive in his attitude towards Native Americans. He did not view them as human beings in the same way that European Americans were. And um, he had this quote, which, you know, blew my mind when I heard it, that the natural fate of indigenous people when they're in the face of civilization is to simply melt away. Even in your, your grandmother's writings, she talked about the seeing people that were loathsome. Oh my God. She was suddenly faced with natives, you know, and black people who she had never seen, and she was appalled by them. You know, Who Do You Think You Are airs Sunday on TLC. Tony, I appreciate you coming by, sharing your family oh, story. Thanks. It was so riveting to me. I, I watched it twice. Oh, that's so great. <laughs>